were fans of the 80s cartoon. Yes, Your absolutely. characters were actually created for the 1987 cartoon. I do know this. Although, they had an appearance in the 1991 film, Secret of the Ooze, but under different names. Did you know that? It, yeah, they, yeah, there were different they're characters. Different guys. Too. Like, like Rizar and Taka. Yeah, they were different yeah. dudes. Almost like a bird thing or something. Yeah, it, wasn't, was, it, was, yeah. it wasn't a war. 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 It wasn't a but since you were fans of the 80s cartoon, what did you want to bring to your characters in this film that you loved so much in that cartoon? That's so funny. Like, uh, when we got the role, uh, and we pretty much got it right about the same time. Yeah, same time. Uh, so I downloaded all of the 80s cartoons to rewatch them because I watched them all as a kid. And then I went and got different comic books, like from, from different artists and everything, just so that we could kind of like steal those things that we loved. And we actually sat around, remember we sat around the coffee shop one day, yeah. like watching like footage of rhinos and warthogs and stuff, just to steal things <laughs> that we like. I did everything that he said, but I just did it way better. Yeah. Uh, and more intense. Yeah. And faster. Too. I'm more, yeah, way faster. Yeah, he does everything better and faster than I Yeah, do. it's this, this kind of thing, you know what I mean? But uh, no, we did, I, and, uh, to bring justice to the characters, that's the whole thing. It's like, make sure that like, these, like bring when you, like such a, serious role to bring like two iconic characters rocksteady yeah. bebop like you got to make sure you, you do them justice and you, you you know bring a lot of fun to them too but you know because there's just so, so many hardcore fans out there that want who are waiting yeah. to see these guys and you want to you want to be literally the ones like wow you nailed it you have a leg I'm a man ow <laughs> you have a le you honestly it sounds silly we're talking about a big fun fun funny cartoon but you have a legacy to live up yeah. to and you don't want to let those fans down and you don't want to let yourself down because you were a fan of the cartoon as well. It is a lot. Well, it is, the whole movie is just so much fun. That's all it is. It's from from beginning to end. It's action packed um, and it's it's a whole lot of fun. A lot of heart and I mean I, to me it is the greatest. It's the greatest short movie we've ever made. It's the it's one. It's fun and heart mixed together. Yes. Fart. Uh oh. oh. Fun <laughs> art. Fun That's art. Good. That's good marketing, Fun. guys. <laughs> I I actually, we set up online and came up that together. We came up with I it. thought that you guys did mocap, but then I asked Tyler Perry what it was like working across from you guys in the mocap suit, and he said that he didn't. He actually spoke to dolls. You well, guys were replaced by dolls. Well, no, no. Well, first of all, Tyler Perry, true and untrue. Okay, Tyler, <laughs> true and untrue. Okay. No, we did part mocap, and then Stuckman did some of it. And then, of course, there was the stuff that Tyler was talking dolls. about. Dolls. Unless Tyler just... He likes talking to dolls. Talks to dolls all the time. I mean, like, right now, that's he, a whole other Tyler's story. Tyler's in the other room right now doing an interview with a doll. <laughs> if the purple ooze was real and you were actually injected with it, what animals in real life do you think you would turn into? I know what I would hope I would turn into. Okay. The peregrine falcon. The fastest animal in the world. The peregrine. Flies yeah, at about too. 200 miles per hour. Get anywhere you want to. Be trafficked. I know. <laughs> that's great. No TSA. No TSA. That's cool. They don't have to frisk me. Not when I'm a peregrine. Like, well, you can't frisk me. You can't catch me to frisk me. I'm a peregrine falcon. What would you be, man? I think I, I'm very happy with being a rhino. Very, very happy. There ain't not much gonna stop this fella right here. You know what I'm saying? Gary's just except the peregrine falcon. Gary's just upset because like, from two hundred at two hundred miles per hour, I would just come just come up to you. And you know what? I, I, I let you do two hundred mile an hour, and then when you get tired. I just step on you right away, fella. I won't get. You know, you just started a war here. <laughs> Twitter war. Twitter, we can have a Twitter war. Twitter war. It's not on Twitter. Actually, you. I am at Gary A. Williams. <laughs> He's still not verified. He's trying to get verified, <laughs> verified for the last year. I'm not even verified yet. Can we get verified together? Made in Hollywood. Thanks for watching this interview. As always, don't forget to subscribe and let us know what you think in the comment section below. For the next Made in Hollywood interview, click right here. Do it. Click it.